Me va a pensar. I almost didn't recognize you without the scales. Excuse me? Oh, cut the act. There's no way you would let yourself fall under the power of Regina's curse when she's still awake. You don't seem very well. If you're looking for Dr. Hopper, his office is just down the street. All right, enough games. I put my daughter through a wardrobe because you told me it would break the curse. Now, where is she? I have no idea what you're talking about. And I don't appreciate the tone. Intimidation won't make me remember something I don't know. I guess Snow is wrong. Looks like we're going to have to find Emma on our own. Emma. What a lovely name. Perhaps I can help you. You are awake. Just needed a proper wake-up call. One that I knew one day would come. All right, so where is she? Where's my daughter? I know that Emma is destined to break the curse, but I don't know where she is and how she's meant to get back to us. Think harder. Tell me, dearie. What was it that woke you from your miserable little life in the first black pit? It was a flower of snow found. It's magic woke us. The pixie. Dust from that flower has the ability to reunite anyone who shares true love. Like snow, me. And your daughter. Emma? Everything okay? Yeah, fine. Let's drop the search crew. Yeah, we did, but if we're gonna find that flower before we're both asleep for good, we're gonna need your mother's tracking skills, which means it's time for me to say goodnight. How do you do it, Dad? You and Mom have been separated by the curse for weeks. And you still find a way to work together. Well, even though I can't be with her, I know that she's fighting for me just as hard as I am for her. And I know a hook is out there doing the same for you. Thanks, Dad.